Hello, my name is Josiah Ray. I'm going to show you how to make a video mask using Colorista in After Effects. This is really useful for controlling sort of an area of effect where your color gets applied. Um, I'll show you a quick demonstration where you can really use it to imply emphasis on a particular object or to create a nice mood. So here I've got this uh, little shot from a badger cam that I have been working with. And you can see it going back and forth. What I'm going to do is highlight just the car body. So with the video clip selected, I'm going to go to Effect, come down to the red giant color suite, and go to Colorista 2. You see from the red lines I'm currently using the trial. But let's go ahead and we'll scroll down, and we don't want the primary color just yet. If you open up the secondary color, it gives you access to what's called the power mask. So let's go ahead and select a, uh, an elliptical mask. We'll move it up over here over the car. I'm going to make it just a little bit bigger. There we go. And what we're going to do is I'm going to desaturate everything outside the car and keep the car itself highly saturated. Um, I might pump the saturation a little bit with the primary color. You can do this by inverting the mask. So we'll go ahead and click invert and then we'll grab the secondary saturation and begin pulling it down. And you can see the saturation around the car begins to drop away. Now if this wasn't inverted, only the car itself would begin to lose saturation. So let's go ahead and do that. I'm not going to pull it down quite all the way, give it a little bit of color. I'm going to come up to the primary color now. And the primary color is only going to affect the car because the secondary color is kind of taken over everything else. So I'm going to increase the saturation just a little bit. I'm also going to pull down the black levels, give it a little bit of a richer look. It's a little bit too much, but that's all right. I'm going to go back to the secondary color, and I'm also going to pull down the, the blacks in this. I'm going to pull it down quite a bit further, though. I'm also going to pull those mid-tones toward, uh, toward the blue-green side of things. That way you get a really nice kind of dead, darker feel around it, and the car seems very alive. I hope you've enjoyed this short video on how to create video masks using Colorista and After Effects. I'm Josiah Ray.